dropping off this gift for JMI and they just let me go down this alleyway and I'm supposed to go around this corner here. Hey, hey, it's your broads. We're calling our squad. Our squad who loves Broadway. The Broadway Broad Squad. We hella love musicals and we review them all day. It's Jen and Sarah. Your fairy god broads. Hey. Places. Hi, I'm Jen. And I'm Sarah. And, and we're, we're the Broadway, Broadway Broads. If you're new here, welcome to the, the Broadway Broad Squad. Yay. <laughs> we are back in the bay. Um, and this review is for Chicago playing at the Ambassador Theater. Guys, this is another check mark for the quest for 41. Whoop, whoop. Yes. Yes. Love, love when we get to have the check mark. <laughs> so good, so good, so good. So we saw this on a Monday night. Um, it was a 7 p.m. show. We sat center orchestra. We had front row seats, row BB seats, 112, 113, 114, because Allie from Alamo Magic was with us. Yes. Oh, she's like our new theater our new, bestie. Our new alternate yep. broad. <laughs> this is crazy. I'm dropping off this gift for JMI, and they just let me go down this alleyway and supposed to go around this corner here for stage door here we go okay yep wow here we go so dropped off a little bay area love to bay area born jmi james monroe i heart um so ali teamed up with us so we usually our signature that we usually drop off to uh, our friends on broadway is a box of seas candy which is known here in the bay area um a box of san francisco seas candy and then we gave him some shows uh some keychains mm -hmm. of the shows that he's been in and ali gave those to him so yeah. that was really really cool to be able to drop that off always fun yeah um Okay, so getting into the theater, um, the ambassador did a fine job checking vaccinations. Uh, we appreciate that. Mm -hmm. um, of course, when we entered, we headed directly to merch. Yes, we did. <laughs> Allie, Allie was with us at the merch as well. Um, I did get, so it's the 25th year of the revival. Um, so they had a pin, which is already hanging up there. Um, it's a pin that says 25 uh, Chicago. So I did pick that up. Mm -hmm. um, and have to say, another fellow merch person, um, we met Daryl, and he was so kind to us it was mm -hmm. so nice to be able to just chit chat uh, about broadway and our love for it yeah and he hooked us up with this this is i've never received one of these before from a merch table mm -hmm. um and it's for your first broadway show so hang to the end because this is going to one of our broadway broad squad yeah it's one to put on your playbill and one to wear proudly your very first Broadway show. <laughs> love it. I just love Fantastic. it. Fantastic. Yeah, so cool. Um, again, this theater was dry, obviously, mm -hmm. uh, for reasons of COVID. Um, it just mitigates people having to take their mask off mm -hmm. to, to sip their drinks, which I yep. totally understand. Totally. Um, yep. So that's fine. Dry people, theater. People don't follow the rules, so they just cut it and made it less. Yeah. yeah. So not a problem. Not a problem. Um, we actually did not hit the restrooms at this theater. No. I mean, I think because our hotel was literally next door, so I don't think... Right next, right next door. door. So we didn't... Yeah. yeah, we didn't need to. We didn't need to. <laughs> However... We did sit, like we said, in the very front row, and this, we had not planned on seeing the show. We had planned on going home, but the morning, the morning that this show was announced, that JMI announced that he was going to be in the show, actually Broadway World announced yeah. it, I took a screenshot, sent it to Sarah and Allie, said, um, so are we doing this? Well, and we were scheduled to we leave were, yeah. on Monday, on Monday, which and the sh he was, you know, debuting this on role Monday. on Monday, yeah. and it was like... But you guys, no brainer. Like, come so, on. yeah, ran right down, look at the website, found front row, bottom, and that was extended yeah. the hotel, figured it out, yep. and yep. we were there. Yep, yeah. exactly. God, so glad we did. So, so glad we did. Yeah, clearly, we have a lot of love for JMI. We're, we're huge fans. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Thank you so much. Do you think I could have one more? 
Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Squad. So when you enter the ambassador, um, you walk in and the curtain is drawn and Chicago on the curtain in sparkly gold letters. So sparkle, sparkle, sparkly like an ice skate, skate mouth. mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I think I said that to you multiple times. And Absolutely. Like, yep. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, so there really is no set per se, right? The mm -hmm. band is on stage and a very, very, very big part of the show. Right? Yes. The conductor is involved. He's got is, lines. He's got lines. <laughs> totally involved with it. Yeah. Absolutely love that. Loved it. Um, the dancers are on stage. Mm -hmm. um, you really enjoyed that. The chairs, they're just lined up on the side. And so it's very much like we're there for the show. Yeah. And they're there with us. And it felt like, you know, court scene battles and all that kind of stuff. It felt like they were part of a jury, like just sitting on the side. I just, I love that they were on stage. And like you said, they're dancing like majority of the show. So yeah. it makes sense that they would be on stage. But I just love that they were on both sides, just sitting there watching the show. So. Let's talk a little bit about these costumes. Oh my God. And being up front, like... Wow. So, you know, I didn't bring a fan because it was going to be, it was freezing, freezing in cold. York, but yeah. I could have used one in this show. Hot, hot, hot. And it's like, I think they do a great job. There's a variety of types of, of revealing and not so revealing, yet revealing. Um, very revealing. <laughs> so just a very hot, hot, hot show yes. as far as costumes Ooh, are concerned. Razzle dazzle for Your broads sure. were here for it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Every moment of yes. it. Yes. Um, so, and also... The set has a trap door, like a reveal. So mm -hmm. there's, you know, um, people can make some entrances and some exits um, that, you know, stand out. Um, but that's pretty much where the technicality of the set stops, right? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, when you have dancers that dance the way they do, you don't need much of a set. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Isn't right? that a line that, that um, Melvin says in Angie Proud? Like, they're like, well, when you can sing and, and dance, and dance, and dance like, like that, that, you don't need, <laughs> yeah, about the Supremes, you're so yeah, right. Yeah, so yeah. I mean, the cost. Yeah. Um, okay, so from the top of the show, we get all that jazz. And again, hot, hot, hot. That's how we start the show. So it yeah. sort of sets the tone. And wow. I've never seen the show... I've seen it once, like community theater, so it never even really hit my radar. I know the movie, um, but to be able to see it on Broadway, to see Fosse's Foz movement on Broadway and at this caliber, like I, I was just to hear these songs that I've heard for years and years and years and yeah. get to see them performed literally right in front of me. Those uh, seats. <sighs> You're so awesome at that, girl. I just have to say, oh, like, again, oh. thank you. Thank you. <laughs> um, okay, so let's talk a little bit about some stand-up performances and some stand-up moments. Okay, okay. Because there's quite a few. Oh, my gosh. Um, oh, my gosh. So, first and foremost, I'm getting goosebumps right now, Cell Block Tango. I've seen it redone. I've seen it reimagined. I've seen gender swap. I've seen it every which way. But to see it again on Broadway, and these girls are killing it. Yeah. It was sexy. It was steamy. They sang good. They talked good. They looked good. Just loved it. It yeah. was, yeah, goals, goals. Um, I think um, a highlight for me was Amos. Um, I actually had the pleasure of seeing him the last time I saw Chicago, um, and he's just remarkable. He like really every time is. he came on stage, I was like, "Ooh, yay!" Oh, yeah. He's <laughs> and speaking just... of, anytime somebody came on stage, uh, oh, the God. man that we stayed in New York for, JMI. Uh, JMI. Yeah. Oh my God. So he comes on and the conductor it gets all hyped up to announce Billy. And I'm telling you, like that audience, they knew it was JMI's yeah. first night performing the show because when he came up, it almost got a standing ovation. Like it was, it was intense. Yeah. It was just such a privilege to get to see our Bay Area boy on stage. Yeah. Again, we've seen and, him in several shows on What Broadway. a great role for him. I mean, oh, like man, honestly, I like know. he just the swagger, yeah. like all of that, yeah. you know. Yeah. Um okay, we do have to mention one thing. So, um <sighs> when JMI made his entrance, there was just a little kind of like trip or skip or catch on the stair. The stair. Yeah. The, I mean, he part, recovered. Oh, yeah. Immediately. But both of us like I think we grabbed like my, my, my heart <sighs> jumped into my throat. It was like I felt like oh. I um but of course he recovered 100%. Totally. Totally. It, was like, it even, never happened. Didn't even sweat. I think we yeah. were sweating and it was, you know, I think that degrees, just shows like, that we we have, we have just we're huge fans and we have so much love for him that it was like, no, God, no. Yeah. And then yeah. just perfect. I mean, no didn't problem. even like, I, I mean, that if that was me, that would have laid me out. Like I would have, that being career ending, <laughs> you know, I mean, he but just. But no, it didn't, you know, and what's funny is I remember thinking, and maybe this is an old, like, 
adage that I don't know and I'd love to hear your comments below but you know that whole like bad dress rehearsal great opening night or whatever and so if that's the little trip up that James will have well then so be it and he gets to have a fantastic yeah yeah. flawless rest yeah. of his run because so. again that was his very just him walking on he hadn't even saying anything he yet. hadn't said a word and yeah. once he did i mean all yeah, yeah. Just i forget forgot it. all forget about it. that yeah uh, so yeah. speaking of so his reach for the gun <laughs> was so good. so good his chemistry again for his first performance his chemistry with roxy was fantastic yeah. that's charlotte dm was i hope i still uh, saying that correctly she's, yeah she's like quintessential roxy she's played it all over the world. I saw her before and I remember being like, that's Roxy Hart. Like, that's I, a hell of I, a Because I had seen, I've seen Chicago a lot. Yeah. And I always feel like they cast Roxy too young. And so this is a broad that has been, Because they're you know, supposed to be, right? Yeah. I think you corrected me because I was, I didn't know that. I thought they were, like, even from the movie, you you know, you see these younger, you know, Renee Zellweger and Catherine Zeta back then. But they're supposed to be older broads. Well, yeah, they, you, it, you hear you know? her history and all the things she's been through. Yeah, and she, she had a show he, then, and then they did a show here. Like, yeah, they should be a little older. And so, I again, their chemistry. And in that number, I specifically remember a moment with her and James where she was like, you got this, You got babe. this, buddy. Like, it, got, was, yeah, it was awesome. Yeah. And to be that close and, and to be able to see he that. he just tosses her around like a doll, like no big deal. And their banter and his puppet voice. Yeah. Uh, his puppet voice was so good. Perfect. I just, yeah, yeah, loved it. Loved it. Yep, yep, yep. So speaking of Roxy, so <laughs> there's also when she does her big number, um, she goes up to the conductor and grabs his baton and starts orchestrating. I mean, just yeah. loved it. I don't know if they do that in every and then, show. And then at the end, she like gives it back. And she's like, to "That's exhausting." <laughs> and he's like, "Right, right." <laughs> Love that. Fantastic. And for me, a standout was just cellophane. That oh. number gets me every time, and he is perfect. Yes. In that and number. then even how the, the the ensemble is on the side, and they're they're watching the whole thing. But as soon as he comes out, little Amos comes out to sing a song. They turn around and they just go like this. They're not even watching. Yeah. And then when Billy comes out, then they turn back around and then they they watch. And then when Billy leaves, they turn back around and they don't pay any mind. I know he he yeah. really stole my heart once again. Yeah, he's um, just that was a standout. Even for me. his exit, he's like, okay, my exit music, please. Okay, no, and then walks away. <laughs> oh my god, that was so good, so good. Okay, oh. so favorite song of the show. I got to give it to the cell block tango. I mean, yeah. again, seeing Fosse's moves up there. Was, That's a moment like, yeah. yeah, getting to see that number on Broadway is Yeah, is something else. I remember just sit, sitting there going, you're, you're here, Jenny. You're yeah. here. And just yeah. being so, oh, yeah. I love those yeah. moments. Yeah, what about you? Uh, for me, it's cellophane. I just, mm. I, I love that number. And yeah. he just was perfect with his Yeah. Name. He, yeah, just so white gloves good. and just, yeah, really, really, yeah. really amazing. I get that. Uh, okay, repeat attend or not. Hell yeah. 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 This Hell is, yeah. I this would is... definitely see. I, if you would have asked me that before the show, I probably would say, no, I'll see it once and be done. But I would love to see any time somebody yeah. new is coming in. I'd love to see And it. you get that with this show a lot. Like, to me, this is on the caliber of Phantom and Broadway. Oh, like, okay. you, you either see Phantom or you see Chicago. And I'm talking about, like, you know, tourists that come in and out. Like, if they're right. just, like, so everybody should, like, if see phantom on broadway see chicago on broadway like that it's like a quintessential yeah, yeah. must see yeah see yeah. and i i normally i would have been like meh, meh, whatever yeah. you know i only went because jmi and now i'm a i'm a fan yeah. i definitely want to see it again definitely. yeah we'll see we'll see so squad guess what we got to meet a couple of our squad members. Unfortunately, Sarah ran to the store right after the show, and Allie and I were still standing outside. And this lovely young man came up to me and Allie and said, I'm sorry to bother you, but I've noticed your your, your hoodie. Um, you're the Broadway Broads, right? And I said, yes. And his name was Thomas and his lovely girlfriend, Delaney. They are from, I believe they're from Florida area. Anyway, they came up and said hello. We took a photo. I'll insert it here. It was just lovely to yeah. get to meet them. So happy. Squad, listen up. So this has happened to us a couple times where after a show, we'll get back and, you know, we're like debriefing as we do. Mm -hmm. And then we'll get messages that some of you saw us at the theater. Um, and here's the thing. We're, we're a couple of old broads. <laughs> we're not as savvy and we're not on the media while we're at the theater. So we may miss your direct messages. If you see us at the theater, 
come Say over. Hi. We want to thank you for supporting yeah. us, for being part of the squad. We, we got usually, a photo. Yeah. yeah. We usually have a sticker with us or something. one of our buttons yeah. or, or something. So we would love to get the opportunity to meet you. And no pressure. Like, like if you don't want a photo or you don't want your photo mm -hmm. on, in video or whatever, we won't do that. But if you do, we would love to, love to put you in the video yeah. as well. So Because again, our goal yeah. is to keep all of us, you know, a community of Broadway Broad Squad, right? Yeah. So now D Delaney and Thomas, you know, who we've sent them lights of Broadway cards. It was so lovely to hear them say that, yeah. you know, and so now just to have that full circle moment, this is why we have this channel. This is why we have yeah. this community of the Broadway Broad Squad. So, so please don't hesitate. If you see your Broad yeah. Theater, please come say, come say hello. Nothing makes us happier than meeting our squad members, yep. right? Yep, absolutely. We have a curtain call to share. Be sure to stick around till the end because you know you got a giveaway. Eddie Bennett, Serena Lambert, Rachel Shore, Michael Storato, Christine Roy Smith, Ryan O, Jennifer Boucher. would like to enter in the giveaway please be sure to read the rules below in the description box and uh so this one's fancy this one's fancy it's so, a really nice play yeah bill. so <laughs> this is the playbill and if you guys remember and to our new squad members i'm trying to pare down my magnet collection <laughs> so i do have this chicago magnet uh so those two will be going to somebody um the question is the giveaway is what is name your favorite Chicago song? Okay. Also have one more giveaway. So Daryl was kind enough, like we said, to give us this.
which is my first Broadway show. Um, it goes on a playbill. So if one of our squad members has not been to Broadway, but is going soon and would like this, comment below when you're going, what you're seeing, and we'll pick somebody to send this to. Okay? Mm, love. <laughs> Thank you so, so much, squad, for joining us. We really appreciate each and every one of you. Yep, and we will see you on the other side. Curtain. Oh, that was a fun video. What'd you think? I loved it. I had a great time. What did, did you guys think? Yeah, did you guys love it? Did you love it? Huh? 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 Well, if you did, guess what you should do? You should definitely like it. And you should subscribe and hit that bell notification so that you know every time that your broads drop content. Yay! We'll see you on the other side. Bye! Bye! Your fairy god broads. Hey!